All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms, and data structures beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. Step 70. All right. So we're going to add a third object to the locations array. We'll give it the same properties as the other two objects. And we'll set the name to cave, the button text to fight slime, fight fang beast, and go to town. Pardon me, go to town square. Then we'll set the button functions to fight slime, fight beast, and go town. And then we'll set the text to you enter the cave, you see some monsters. All right. So for this one, we're just going to copy and paste this one right here. So let's take it from uh, 31 right before the uh, colon, pardon me, comma, to all of 26. And let's copy that. And then let's just paste it here in 32. And we would usually need to put another comma there, but they put one there for us. So let's just remember that. So let's change this name to cave. All right. And then we'll change this first one to fight slime, fight, whoa, whoa, whoa. fight slime like this. The second one will do fight fanged beast. So fight fanged beast. Best. B-E-A-S-T. How about that? All right. And then we've got go to town square. We'll keep that. And then right here, we'll do fight slime, fight slime. We'll do the next one. Fight beast, fight beast like that. And then we'll change this one to uh, you enter the cave. You see some monsters. So let's just select store right here and change it to uh, cave period space. You see some monsters like that. And that should take care of it. Uh, let's see. We haven't done anything to the Go Cave yet, so it still hasn't done anything. But let's uh, check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 71. And we'll see you next time.